Hey there everybody, this is Brian from Gaining Experience, and welcome to Nelson Tethers, Puzzle Agent. This would be a gun if I hadn't already packed all my prop guns. Oh. Since we're doing Doom as a sister series of this, like on the other side of this as well, um, and I just finished Rise and Shine, and that was such an adrenaline rush at the end, I want to do something a little bit more chilled out. So that's why we're doing this. Yeah, if anybody wanted to ask any questions about that, so... Without any further ado, let's start up the game. I have never tried this game before, although I love puzzle games and stuff like that, if you could tell by my quantum... My quantum conundrum. I don't know why, I always want to go to quantum mechanics, but it's... that's a thing. Quantum conundrum playthrough. You know that I love puzzle games. I especially love puzzle games that are fun. This looks like it'll be a fun puzzle game. I hope you guys enjoy it as much as I will. <laughs> I also love the art style. It's very... Sunday... no, Saturday morning cartoons in the, uh, newspapers. Just looking. Oh, the animation's, uh, janky as hell like that, too. I like it. Summer's new moon. Today's crossword. Okay. U.S. Department of Puzzle Research. Because <laughs> they definitely have enough money for that right now. Let's see. Oh, candy. Ooh, piece of candy. Where's that gum? I think that was gum. It's gum. <laughs> Waiting for him to have a little connection fit. Oh, tired. <sighs> Dude, don't yawn like that. You make me. Oh, that's not cool. Oh, yawning is infectious, you jerk. <laughs> Something sounds interesting. What the hell is that? Oh, that was a Sudoku Man thing. Hey, me. What? What the fuck? <laughs> oh, he had a nightmare. Okay. Although I do love the Sudoku Man poster. I want to see it. A hero like that. Hang on, I'll defeat them with my Sudoku. <laughs> <laughs> Nelson Tether's crossword puzzle has been ripped to bits, but is there something running on it? Reconstruct it to find out. Solve it. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Neat. I like ye. Oh. I go with this. Oh, thank God they clicked together. Oh, that's gonna make my life a lot easier. Okay, you're gonna go over here. I'm gonna stick you onto here. Nope. Actual, actual puzzle. Get out of here. Okay, you're going over there. See if we can get this all situated nice and goodly. Wait a minute. What the fuck? Can you rotate pieces? I think you can rotate pieces. I'm not sure how. But. So, okay. How do I. Huh. That's an interesting thing. I don't know how to rotate anything yet. Because clearly it looks like some of these pieces need to be rotated to fit in properly. I could be wrong. Maybe. There's that one. Uh, this one? Okay, there's that. Okay. Oh! Okay, we're getting somewhere. And time to stall out. Okay. Skunigans. Skunigans? Taxpayer dollars spent. Oh, I am sorry. <laughs> Crack the crossword. <clears throat> yeah, no hints. Wrong answers. None. Ten stars. That is ten, right? Yes. And look at my smug little grey. <laughs> Dude, can you relax? That's a spider. Uh, puzzle research. This is Agent Tethers. It's voice acting! I think you have the wrong number. Oh, I see. A an assignment. Oh. In the field? No, no, sir. It's it's just, it's been, yes, quite some time. Neat. Uh-huh. Erasers? Mm -hmm. The foundation of democracy? 
Oh, absolutely, sir. I agree, sir. Oh, oh yes, okay. the White House needs its erasers, sir. I'll be on the next huh. plane to... Wait, where? Guggins. Scoggins. Oh, Scoggins. Okay. I thought that was an extra O. Oh, my bad, my bad. <sighs> I'm liking this game already. It's kind of got its own little kitschy vibe to it. Nelson Tips, Puzzle Agent. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> that is a wide ass road for a small town. It's got that very pencil drawnish theme to it, which I guess makes sense since it's a puzzle game and they're about investigating erasers. Just <coughs> arrived in Scoggins, Minnesota. <laughs> Scoggins, Minnesota. Population 754. Temperature mm, cold as balls. It's cold and not much to look at. According to the agency, there's some kind of situ in thing going on at the local okay. eraser factory. The whole plant is shut down. That's not a good. There's a weird man staring at me. Hopefully, this won't be a big waste of time. <clears throat> I'll start talking to him. Agent <clears throat> Tether's out. Oh, there you go. Make sure you leave a delineation where to stop checking the recording. I have no idea where my hotel is. <clears throat> I might have to ask for directions. <clears throat> Talk to the creepy man. He's not that bad looking. Excuse me. I'm Nelson Tethers with the FBI's Department of Puzzle Research. He just looks a little bit disgruntled, but then again, if Hello? you had to sit outside yeah. in the middle of winter okay. have a smoke, I would assume you'd are... be a little bit unhappy too. Bjorn. Bjorn? Bjorn. Yeah. Nice huh. to meet you, Mr. Bjorn. Likewise. Boy, those snowmobiles sure are a bumpy ride, eh? Ah, oh, I used A! That's so Canadian, I like it. Can oh, you give me puzzle. directions to the nearest <clears throat> hotel? I'm having a little trouble finding my way around. You'd never get there. Roads are too slick. Sir, I'm an agent of the FBI's Puzzle Research Division. It can't be harder than the puzzles I see every day. Not Let's so. See. It's really just a, a matter of trajection. Okay, on the way okay. to the hotel, you're going to pass two traffic lights. Two traffic lights. Nelson Snowmobile is sliding along the roads. Arrange the logs to help Nelson bump his way to the hotel. Make sure to pass the traffic lights Bjorn mentioned along the way. So, two traffic lights. Drag lines from the menu onto the same grid. game grid. A log can be dragged to any free space. Nelson Snowmobile will start off heading south. When it hits a log, it will bank left or right or left depending on the log's orientation. Nelson must hit every stoplight on his way to the hotel. Press submit when you think the logs are arranged correctly. We can do this. Nice and easy. So, bing. Gotta go up. Then that way, then down to there. Okay. So we. Oh, that's easy. Come on. Give me a hard one next time. Go! <laughs> Bink! 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 Dun dun! This. <laughs> Still sorry about that tax tear thing. That's a lot of money I'm spending on you guys. Sorry about that. On the bright side, I'm not wasting it. I'm getting it all done super fast time. Ten stars. Yeah. Top agent. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> because the start of this game was really chatty and slow to begin with, I think I might do this one as a 15 minute one. This was the fucking hotel and he's a prick. Um, I must have gotten lost. I thought your directions were taking me to the hotel. They did. Uh, I'm standing in front of the hotel, aren't I? Yeah. Thanks a lot. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> I like him. He's a dick. <sighs> I'm here to investigate Factor. an incident at the Scoggins Eraser Factory. Do you know anything about it? It's a good question. No. Nope. That was a quick the end of hotel's conversation. going to close soon. Better check in if you're sneaking around. Suspicious Seen people? any suspicious people hanging around the hotel lately? Yep. Really? You? Can you describe them? Skinny asks lots of questions. 
There's a stupid hat. <laughs> Thanks. Talking about tip. me. Yep. Uh, I saw that one coming. See you. Inspect the fence. Okay. That's bite marks. Discovered a fence. Boards all chewed up something terrible. Could be the work of strays trying to get to the dumpsters back there. I don't know why I'm reporting this. Me either. They told me to do it, so I did it. Go inside the hotel. I want it. It's a small hotel. That's a lot of gnomes. Oh, he looks like he's going to be a treat to talk to. <laughs> I can already tell. Hello. Let's go talk to well, her. Hello there, mister. Welcome to Valda's Inn. I'm Martha Garrett, but everyone calls me Ma. How can I help you? I'm Nelson Tethers. I have a reservation. Oh, yeah. You're here about the Eraser Factory, eh? Yep. We're awfully excited to have a real FBI man in our town. It's just uh -huh. like TV, yeah? Ooh, I'm going to make some hot dish for you later. A hot dish? Oh, you'll love it. I've never met a man who didn't love himself some hot dish. This is so kitschy and so... I want to say... So, uh, what room am I in? Yeah, okay, I've got your room I know room it's right an American here. town, but it just screams Canadian oh, dear. This accent is style. so embarrassing. The night clerk wrote down your room number in code. Hmm. Mind if hmm. I have a look? I bet I can figure out what room I'm in. Let's crack this buggy. Night, night, the security-minded night clerk no, notated Nelson's room number in cryptic form. Help Martha see what's written on it. Yeah, what's written so you can get your key. Wow, my brain just... It says nine. <laughs> that was easy. I couldn't have been any faster. Why am I spending $75,000, almost 76 rounded up on this? Wow! Again, I'm sorry, American people. I'm spending so many of your tax dollars right now. Imaginary tax dollars. Don't worry, I'm not really spending anything. <laughs> How? There you go, Mrs. Garrett. Oh, yeah, now I see. Okay, then. Here's your room key, FBI man. Yay, thank you. Thanks. Actually, while I have you here, do you mind if I ask you a couple questions? Real couple quick, questions, I sure. promise. Oh, yeah, of course. The guy in the lobby, is he okay? Oh, that's Bo Murphy. He's always been a bit of an odd one. Yeah, he uh. sits there all day trying to do his puzzles. <laughs> he mostly keeps to himself, and I bring <clears throat> him some food from time to time. Sometimes uh. I swear he'd starve to death if I didn't bring him something to eat. Okay. Do you know razors? anything about the problem at the factory? Yeah, so tragic about the accident, huh? Accident? accident? Oh, yeah, the foreman, Isaac Davner, they say he was killed in there. Oh. Is that so? Well, not to be gossipy, but I heard the accident was caused by raccoons. Raccoons? raccoons? Yeah, little creatures that live in the woods around the oh, factory. Oh, I know what raccoons are. Maybe you should go talk to Sheriff Bog about it, though. You should be able to catch him out by the factory right now. Okay, okay. I'll do that. Thank you. How Looking do I around. get to the factory from here? The FBI doesn't know where the factory is? Oh dear, our moose is cooked. Rest assured, ma'am, the goose. FBI just likes that was just to a little bit pushing confirm too hard. intelligence with civilian knowledge of... We like to double check things. Oh, there you go. of course. Well, it's easy. I have a tourist map of our little town of Scoggins right here. Oh, thank you. You know, our Scoggins Erasers is the plant that supplies the White House with all of its erasers. Ah. The president could be fixing a mistake with a Scoggins Eraser right now. Yes, ma'am. That's why I'm here. That and the fact that every time the Bureau made an inquiry into the situation, all oh. we ever got back were bizarre puzzles. Okay. Oh, yeah. Well, that'll happen. Ah. Uh. Thanks. You seem very well, nonchalant goodbye. about Enjoy that. Enjoy your stay. Oh, that reminds me. Nope. Do you have any gum for sale? Or know where I can buy some? Dear, we've been out of gum for quite some time. What? Haven't seen a stick in hmm. months anywhere in town. We tend to get shipments of things like that in the spring. 
So, no gum? Nope. Gum helps me concentrate. Pick up the ABC gum. Ew. Oh, where is it? Oh, it's right there, isn't it? All right, I'll get that next time. Oh, it's going to be gross. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, I know it's a bit more chill than the last videos I did, but I needed something to relax after the harrowing experience of trying to beat Rise and Shine at the end of that, because that one was hard. Uh, if you haven't seen that one, do check out the series. It's really fun. You get to see me suffer a bit, and you get to see me succeed eventually. That's always good news. And uh, if you want, make sure you hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. If you want to, leave a comment, because we love talking to you guys. And if you already subscribed, but you're not getting our videos, make sure you hit that notification bell. Ring that bell! And I'll catch you, XP Grinders, in the next level. Later.